Israel is now getting hit by mortars from Syria in addition to rockets from Lebanon, and Israel is responding with counter-battery fire. So far, 1,000 Israelis have been killed with another 3,400 injured, and reportedly 900 Palestinians have been killed with another 4,500 injured. This is Israel is preparing a months-long ground campaign in Gaza, according to Egypt, with the Times of Israel reporting that Egypt also said that Israel has dismissed their efforts to mediate any kind of de-escalation. The Times also saying it's believed that Israel wants to destroy Hamas before entertaining a ceasefire. Also, the Wall Street Journal reporting the United States may deploy a second aircraft carrier strike group to Israel. This is the USS Gerald Ford has arrived off the coast of Israel and will likely begin operations tonight. This has also made Erdogan very mad at Israel and the United States, with him angrily asking today, why is the U.S. aircraft carrier coming to Israel? For what? What will they do? Will they hit Gaza with their warplanes and commit a massacre? Though Jake Sullivan responded, saying, let me be clear, we did not move the carrier for Hamas. We moved the carrier to send a clear message of deterrence to other parties who may seek to widen the war. But as always, this is a developing situation, so follow to stay in the loop.